Chrissy, Sam and Brownie. It's a podcast bonus. Nova. Chrissy Swan, Sam Pang and Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's celebrity star. Sad news yesterday. Tracy Grimshaw is stepping down from a current affair after 17 years. What? The country's best interviewer, and I won't hear a word against Grimmers. At the end of last night's show, she sprung it on us. <sighs> have a listen. I have some news that I wanted you to hear from me before you hear it from anyone else. I've decided to finish up with a current affair this year. It's been a big decision, huge actually, and before the gossip websites start telling you rubbish, I want you to know it's been my decision alone and I'm not being shoved out the door by the boys club because I'm too old. I'm not too old, I'm just a bit tired. Yes. And for the record, both the boys and the girls have asked me to stay. Hmm. As you would. Now, I know for some reason, Sam, Grimmers isn't one of yours. I was about to say, the last the, the last time Tracy Grimshaw came up, you and I had as close to a fight as we've ever had. Yeah. Which I, I look back and regret. Not the fight, just the the topic. was. I, I, may, have been, I may have been slightly, not disrespectful, but I may not have given Tracy Grimshaw. I said this to Jack the other day. You know, she's a... A, a survivor. Absolutely. Just because I don't like your show, like like you pointed out, doesn't mean that I can't respect your work. Correct. Or, or your... And if it makes it... Jack was telling me off air just before, the great Sarah Arbo, who we all love and respect, she was asked who the best interviewer in Australia is, and guess what our answer was? Tracy Grimshaw. Yeah, well, she probably would have been drunk, by the way. <laughs> Good point. Not a, you know, man, you, see, you, want to, you wouldn't have just wouldn't want to breathalyse Arbo when she's answering questions. <laughs> well, if you're wondering... What time was that? If you're wondering... When, when, did you, when, did you talk to, when did you talk to Sarah about yeah, that? Yeah, no, fair enough. It was 11pm <laughs> out the front of Entrecote. <laughs> um, Grimshaw started out as a reporter in the Channel 9 Melbourne newsroom in 1981. That's 40 years ago or more. Wow. Um, and she is tired, and this is why. I've basically been a shift worker for 26 years now, driving to work before dawn for nine years on the Today Show and the past 17 years driving home after dark here on A Current Affair. And it's time for less of that daily obligation. Thank you for your loyalty. I hope I've repaid it. I'm around until November, then I'm going to take a long holiday, but it's business as usual until then. I really want to get her in. I'm around, I really want to get her in. I'm around in November, Sandra. Like, just pop in if you want. I'm around, <laughs> yeah, around in November, try the V-Hole. Um, Nova. Chrissy Swan, Sam Pang and Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's Celebrity Star. That's huge news. Mm? The Veronica's a splitsville. What? Lisa and Jess have split and announced they're going solo. That'll be weird because we only know them together. Yeah. Lisa and Jess both spruiked their upcoming songs on their individual Instagram pages yesterday morning as they wiped their banned Instagram page of all posts. And this is a welfare check, Sam. Are you okay? You know, I love the Veronica's. What's that, Jack? Who what's doesn't? That, what's that song I liked? It was In My Blood. In My it? Blood, yeah. Mate, that is a tune. Don't have to wait all night. Is that it? Is it? Yeah. Yeah, that's the one. Nah, you like it different. No, one. I like that one. No, I like that one. Isn't that one about a, a needle? Yeah. Forever. Back in the day, forever was my favourite. Things that we can do. Not the tune. I like this one. I'm looking for someone <laughs> other than my wife. <laughs> other than my wife. What's right, though? Ashley Madison's right. I right. say, if, 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 the, if one of the... I know they're split. Or they're, if one of the Veronicas... Mm. It, it's a race to see who covers that. To their first, <laughs> it's their first solo... Their solo activity. I'm looking for someone other than my wife. <laughs> Strength and numbers. Magical. Magical. <laughs> Dennis Walters should do that at Carol's. Come <laughs> <laughs> on. Anyway, uh, there's uh, that's sad. That's sad news, no, but it's also not. exciting news. Double the fun. Double the correct. <laughs> Double the music. Nova, Chrissy Swan, Sam Pang, and Jonathan Brown. Chrissy's celebrity star. One of the maths greats, the royalty, the best ever. Yeah. Martha Kalafatidis and her boyfriend slash fiance slash husband to be Greg, Michael, Michael, Michael Brunelli are expecting a baby. Oh. She disappeared off Instagram. And everyone thought that she had a terrible stomach virus. Turns out she has that hypergravidium or whatever it's called. Hyper, hyperemesis gravidarum. 
which is like super bad morning sickness. Right. So, um, just having a baby, it's exciting. Yeah. Martha and I, we get along better than people think, She's don't the we? best. Yeah, she likes you. Have a listen. It's been a minute since we've been online, so we wanted to explain our situation and make a little bit of an announcement, and that is that Martha is pregnant. It hasn't been like this exciting, wonderful time for us. No. It was a complete surprise. But at five weeks, I was diagnosed with high premises gravidarum, which ah. is the terrible morning sickness. So that explains why she uh, has been so unwell. Hmm. Um, so congratulations, lovers. Grimmers. Tracy Grimshaw is stepping down from a current affair after 17 years, and I, for one, am devastated. Layla McKinnon is going to take over, is the, is the big rumour. Layla I mean, she's born for it. Which one's that? Layla. She's done a whole lot of filling in and you know, like when Trace is on assignment. Is Layla on Channel holidays. 9 stable? Tra- Channel 9 stable? Absolutely. Who, and who, a great bird. Who, so Layla McKinnon. She's who, partner with one of the bosses at Channel 9? Ginjal. That's, that's she famously did the Corey Worthington interview. Yeah, she's great. Oh, that's right. Who does it with Carl? Um, Ali Langdon. Ali Langdon. Right. Yeah. Um, and this is what Trace had to say. I have some news that I wanted you to hear from me before you hear it from anyone else. I've decided to finish up with a current affair this year. It's been a big decision, huge actually, and before the gossip websites start telling you rubbish, I want you to know it's been my decision alone and I'm not being shoved out the door by the boys club because I'm too old. I'm not too old, I'm just a bit tired. And for the record, both the boys and the girls have asked me to stay. There you go. Grimmers. She's, uh, She's uh, business as usual till November. Yes, Sam? No, just, just yes, congratulations. Coming up. And a wonderful career. So when you're sincere, it just doesn't work. Well, people don't like no, it. No, no, no. Wayne Carey coming up? No? Yeah, yeah, he's just at Priceline picking up some Voltaren. Yeah! <laughs> Good morning, Mel. Tomorrow, Chrissy, Sam and Brownie, oh, unless it's a weekend. Here's the 100.